This is honestly delightful. When a world-renowned British children's author and his illustrator wife have their Australian book, book signing tour upended because he gets cancelled for retweeting a neo-Nazi, <laughs> to quote him, sometimes even bad people can make good points. It looks grim for Julian and Ingrid Hartswood and their new book, Big Bear in Space. It only gets more complicated when Austin, who has autistic spectrum condition, introduces himself at a signing and claims to be Julian's son, as we saw in the trailer. Oh, and just based on Austin's age, it looks like he was conceived not long after Julian and Ingrid started dating. Umar, Umar, Umar. Oh, I have loved all of the episodes of Austin that I've seen. I've seen the first three. Um, it, Michael Theo, who you might recognize from Love on the Spectrum uh, and wanting to be an actor, is our uh, central Austin. He's our guy. And so on, on one hand, phenomenal that we've got an actor with autistic spectrum disorder playing a character with autistic spectrum disorder and doing a really good job of it. Um, it is funny in all the right places. Uh, Austin, the, the character, is not... He's not the punchline, if that makes sense. He's a part of the comedy. He's in on the jokes, but it's not like make fun of the disabled guy, right? Like it is it is glorious and inclusive and welcoming. And uh, if anything, we make a lot of fun of Brits who are far too up themselves. You know, that's where we get to meet Julian, of course. Um, even Ingrid a little bit, but that's just sort of around the side. The cast is incredible. Joining Michael uh, is Ben Miller, who plays his dad, Julian, who's also been in Paddington and Death in Paradise. Sally Phillips is Ingrid uh, from, oh, look, honestly, she's in heaps of things, but I'm Alan Partridge, Miranda. She was in Veep as well. Uh, Gia Caridis, if you do not mind, plays Austin's mum. She's been in Big Fat Greek Wedding, I think two and three probably. Uh, Strictly Ballroom, if you can remember that far back. And then playing his grandfather, um, Roy Billing. <laughs> and when I when I went to write down what has he been in, I just wrote, um, everything. Roy Billing has been in everything. And that's because he's so great. So great. Um, I absolutely loved every part of it. And just a quick shout out to Scooter Wellborn, who I know was, I think, uh, one of the ADs shooting for this. Congratulations, mate. Phenomenal effort. Um, the writers uh, include uh, Carla Ellis and Adam Zwa, who I love and got to chat with at um, the, the Colin from Accounts premiere. He and his wonderful wife, Amanda, were there. He's just, they've nailed it. They've nailed it with the tone. Michael even gets a, a Guernsey as a script consultant, obviously, bringing you know to the party his experience with autistic spectrum disorder uh, condition and what that looks like. Um, so super smart, right? Uh, and a, another little Colin crossover, directed by Madeline Dyer, sister of Harriet. It's filmed in Canberra, as you can see. There's lots of great Canberra stuff and in the UK, and I can tell you nothing more than it is glorious and absolutely worth every minute that you want to pour into it. And it doesn't labor, it's it, like it doesn't overstay its welcome. 30 minute episodes, right? It's kicking off this Sunday night paired with the new season of Spicks and Specs. So Spicks and Specs will drop at 7.30. Austin runs at 8. Uh, and once the first episode is aired, all eight episodes will be available on ABC iView for you to binge at your pleasure or just watch it week to week. I, I say it's, it's because it's a half hour, it's really easy to watch. It's really easy to just sit down and be consumed by this world. There is a lot of exposition warning, a lot of exposition that happens in the first episode because they've got to set everything up. And it, again, I don't think it overstays its welcome. It does a really good job. Um, and and full, like full props to, to Madeline as director and to Michael in his performance uh, as Austin. It's fucking great. Uh, and congratulations to Ben, who's the co-creator of this uh, of this series. Brilliant, right? There's just so much to love about it. It's so, so good. And when we're getting so little Australian drama slash comedy uh, on free-to-air television, commercial or even, you know, uh, government like the ABC or SBS, dive in, support it, watch it. iView or, or broadcast, certainly iView is going to give them the best figures, but However you watch it, just watch it. Like I'm at the point where I'm saying, even if you don't like it, 
log into iview press play on the first episode and go and do something else for four hours <laughs> let them think that you've won but you'll want to watch it it's so good anyway austin um the first season eight episodes it's so delightful it starts this sunday the 9th of june 8 p.m on abc or you can flick over and watch all of it on abc iview so you don't have to wait that's the glorious thing <laughs>